It was only a matter of time until Meghan Markle was going to jump into the Princess Catherine drama. up everyone it's me Steph the Alter Nerd your nerdy alternative and welcome to another dose of the Daily Nerd where I break down the royal news and gossip of the day that's pretty much got me eye and oh my goodness let's jump into this madness shall we because yep it looks like Megzi or sources close to her have jumped into the Princess Catherine drama with the whole botched Mother's Day photo incident as, yeah, uh, the Photoshop fail is being mocked by sources close to Megzi and Hazza saying that they would never make that mistake. Hmm, really? Stay tuned for later on in the video on this one, guys. In the meantime, uh, sources close to Megzi and Hazza have waded into Princess Catherine's botched Mother's Day photo situation saying, quote, this isn't a mistake Meghan would ever make and that they would have been annihilated if they had handed out secretly photoshopped images of themselves and their family, sources told Page Six. Yeah, uh, Princess Catherine is being annihilated right now, unfairly. It's absolutely insane out there. Are they not reading or looking at the media at all around this? It's insane. There is no double standard to this whatsoever, not what they're trying to claim. Uh, sources close to Hazard and Megzi have told page six, quote, if Harry and Meghan, <coughs> apologies, had ever encountered the same issue, they would have been annihilated. Yeah, just the same as what Princess Catherine is going through right now. Again, unfairly, it's insane. It should stop. Uh, the same rules do not apply to both couples. This isn't a mistake that Megzi would ever make. She has a keen eye and freakish attention to detail. But wait, guys. Oh, yeah, there's more. Because, yeah, you have got, essentially, as far as I'm concerned, Team Sussex trying to do an absolute media blitz on this to try and mock and slam and kick Princess Catherine while she's down, whilst trying to elevate Megzi at the same time. And here's another example. Uh, we've got Darren Lewis, the assistant editor at The Mirror, saying Kate Middleton's photo controversy is proof Megan was right to get out of the picture. What the deuce here? Saying uh, Megzi must have been delighted to have dodged a bullet. Um, the Megxit situation four years ago was messy and ugly for him and painful. Uh, but every time she switches on the TV and watches the feeding frenzy around Princess Catherine, Megzi must breathe a sigh of relief, guys. Um, every time Megzi sees the internet explode uh, over Princess Catherine's health, the state of her marriage, uh, Megzi apparently should be thankful, must be feeling thankful uh, that she and uh, Hazza trusted their judgment and went it alone. And every time she sees uh, Uncle Jay, uh, Princess Catherine's uncle uh, on Celebrity Big Brother, um, Megzi apparently must rest much easier with all of that. Uh, now, as the UK goes full Kate Spiracy, it's, it's madness, guys. Uh, over that doctored Mother's Day photo, Megzi must feel even more vindicated. Why? Why? Uh, millions of toxic families around the world have members who want to break away, sons or daughters who reject being guilt-tripped into doing things the family way just to keep parents or siblings happy. The family waits for them to fail and come crawling back with their tail between their legs, but they succeed at toughing it out rather than returning. Yeah, recently, and even I've reported it on this channel, there have been so many headlines that Hazard and Megzi want to come back into the raw fold. Even sources close to Hazard turning around and saying he'll tempor temporarily return uh, to take up royal duties whilst King Charles is undergoing the uh, treatment. Come on, dude, what's he talking shiz for? Uh, with her wealth and the TV career she'd had before she even met Hazza, Megzi is blessed enough not to need to go back. She's opposed to girl for empowerment in the face of relentless intimidation and unwarranted attacks. Uh, as she does what she likes when she likes without having a kowtow to the royal rota, watching the Cambridge dumpster fire from afar must be what freedom feels like, especially with Princess Catherine now finding out the optics of the royal fairy tale and no substitute for day-to-day -day peace of mind. Seriously, 
if Megzi did the same thing, there would be an absolute drama around it as well, the same as Princess Catherine. This whole drama has gone global. Everyone's talking about it. Everyone's scrutinizing it, criticizing it. It's insane. It's mad. It needs to stop everyone. Freaking photoshops their photos when they're famous, when they're in the royal family. You think Megzi hasn't done that? Um, yeah, exhibit freaking A, all the way to Z, right? So Megzi was pictured at the in and out burger joint, apparently back um, a year or two ago, right? And so we wanted to go to that in and out burger joint to find out what was going on, how it was, how it happened, everything else. But as we're speaking to the in and out uh, employees, the people that were working there, they're like, um, no, she's never been here. We never saw her. What the deuce, right? Even though here, uh, Megzi has said, you know, it's their fa- one of their favorite joints to go to, right, guys? One of their favorite joints to go to. So if the in and out employees are turning around and saying, hang on a minute, She's not really been here. We don't know her order. We don't know her at all. Then, yeah. What's uh, this picture about, guys? Da, da, da. Yeah. And there's been other instances where Megzi and Hazard have been approved of either photoshopping or faking pictures. And there's been an absolute drama around that. So, no, there is no freaking double standard whatsoever. And Megan's mole, as far as I'm concerned, is hitting the whole thing on the head with Meghan Markle's side, right, using this whole fake photo from Princess Catherine uh, to mock her uh, publicly because... Megan's mole says it here. Wasn't Meghan Markle moaning and complaining about online ABUSE by women on International Women's Day? Not once has Megzi condemned the bullying of Princess Catherine since the announcement of a surgery in January. It's now March and not a single word from the quote force for change and not a single word from her since this whole drama with the botched photo on Mother's Day has started. Apart from... Oh, well, sources are essentially mocking Princess Catherine by saying, you know, Megzi would never make that mistake whatsoever. And, oh, she has dodged a bullet, our Megzi, looking at the Princess Catherine drama. Again, kicking Princess Catherine while she's down to try at the same time elevate Megzi. It's absolutely disgusting. That and the drama surrounding the botched photo from Mother's Day. It's absolutely disgusting. Leave Princess Catherine alone. Everyone who's famous or who's in the royal family, there is an element of Photoshop that goes along with it. Wig the hell up. And when it comes to Princess Catherine's health situation, it's no one's damn business, really, at the end of the day. And as Kensington Palace said back in January, you ain't going to be seeing Princess Catherine until after Easter. And um, by my reckoning, after Easter hasn't happened yet. So calm your tits, everyone. With that being said, if you appreciated this video and you want more, believe me, there's going to be more, make sure you subscribe to join our Alt and Her tribe. I'll be honest with you. Help us get to 100k so we can get that silver play button right there and hopefully cause a Christopher Boozy meltdown on Twitter. Like, share, comment down below your opinion, conspiracy theories, whatever. Also, as well, if you've got some very, very strong thoughts on this one, and I bet you do, then make sure you send me a super thanks. It's just below this video right here we can have a conversation about this because it does guarantee a response from me and until the next time you guys laters